Okay. A pleasant day to everyone. I am Lizelle Fajardo and I'm going to discuss the solution for uh, problem 5.3 given from the book of Kobanower, Process Systems and Analysis. Um, this problem can be found at page 115. So, and the problem goes this way. A tank having a cross-sectional area of 2 feet square is operating at steady state with an inlet flow rate of 2.0 cubic feet per minute. The flow head characteristics are shown in this figure. And now we are tasked to find the transfer function of the process. And also, we are given the condition that if the flow to the tank increases from 2.0 to 2.2 cubic feet per minute according to a step change, uh, we calculate the level H two minutes after the change occurs. Now, in solving this problem, we uh, based on the data given in the graph. So from the data given, we, are, we can arrive equation showing the linear relationship between the outlet flow to the level H. So by getting the slope, we have uh, M, which is the notation of slope, equals to the change in y over change in x, which is equivalent to the change in the outflow concent uh, no, outflow rate uh, with respect to the change of its level. So using these values, we can uh, calculate the slope, which is equivalent to 2. Then uh, we can also uh, arrive with the differential equations by integrating this equation for QO from integ the integral of QO from 1 to QO is equal to the in 2 times the integral of dH from 3 to H. So we can arrive or we can obtain this relationship. The QO is equal to 2H plus 0.4. So then let's proceed to the volume balance. In terms of variables, we have QI, which is the entering flow rate, minus the QO, the outlet flow rate, equals the rate of accumulation in the tank. So. Combining equations 1 and 2, we have uh, this following differential linear equation. But before proceeding to the transfer function, we must introduce a deviation variables. So at first, or initially, the process operating at steady state. So, walay at steady state, wala pa disturbance, wala accumulation. So, ato ang change sa level or dh over dt is equal to 0. So at steady state, we have this equation, qis minus 2, hs minus 0.4 is equal to 0. Since, uh, oh, okay, the subscript s indicates, this subscript indicates that the variable uh, is at steady state. Since, and also, uh, given na ganina nga ato ang qs is equal to 2 cubic feet per minute. So, pwede na to siya i-substitute diri para maka-arrive uh, tag value sa HS or katong uh, level or height sa tubig katong wala pa na disturb. And then, subtracting this, this is equation 4, subtracting with uh, equation 3. This is equation 3. So, we arrive in this uh, equation. So, if we use define uh, define deviation variables, as we will uh, arrive on this form. So, if we use uh, deviation variables, maka arrive at a anina form. So, taking the Laplace transform with this equation, we arrive on this. Laplace of Q minus Laplace of 2H is equal to 2 
times Laplace of dh over dt. The Laplace of q is equal to qs and the Laplace of h is equal to hs. The Laplace of the uh, dh over dt is equal to h uh, times h of s minus h of 0. Since h of 0 is already equal to 0, so wala na siya. And then, uh, rearranging into the standard form of first order systems. This is the standard form uh, first order system. So, we obtain this transfer function. For the second question, we are asked to calculate the levels or the level 2 minutes after the changes occurs given that ang flow ni increase siya from 2.0 to 2.2 cubic feet per minute. So, uh, given naman na step function, so the input disturbance is written as 0 0.2 times UO times T. Taking the Laplace transform of this uh, equation, so the the Laplace transform of QT is QS, and then the Laplace transform of U, uh, 0 0.2 times UO times T is here, so it's 1 over S. Tapos, um, combining this, combining this equation and the transfer function of the process, ma makaobtain taog HS which is um, kanang uh, multiply more uh, times lang or multiply lang ang imuhang transfer function o ang imuhang uh, q of s and then applying partial fraction we get the value of a na 0.1 and b is 0.2 so, uh, taking the inverse Laplace, we arrive on this complete solution. H of t is equal to 0.1 times 1 minus 0.1 e to the negative t. So, mubalik ta diri, ang Laplace inverse sa hs is h of t. So, ang Laplace inverse sa 0.1 over s, 0 0.1 is also cons constant, so pwede rin na siya ni may separate, so 1 over s is equal to 1, minus Laplace inverse of 0 0.1 over s plus 1 is 0 0.1 times e to the negative t. So, so, simplifying, we can get this equation. So, this is the response to the steps, so to the step change of uh, q of t na 0 0.02 times uo t nag apply sa system. So, the question is, pila ang level at time is 2 minutes after the changes occur? So, since we all know na or state na ganina nga ang h is equal to h minus h of s. Muna siya ito hang deviation variable. So, i-equate lang ni mo siya. Which, uh, so, h, of, h minus h of s is equal to 0 0.01 times 1 minus e negative t. So, transpose ang h s. So, we arrive on this. Tapos, uh, okay, h Okay, uh, HS, nga solve na nato gaina, which is 0 0.8 plus 0 0.01 times 1 minus E negative T. T is 2 minutes. So, solving this using calculator, we have height or level na 0 0.8865 feet uh, na level. Okay. <laughs> so that was uh, the problem is all about so I hope you have learned something thank you